our uh, dear uh, viewers and welcome to a new edition of our uh, program uh, today's youth in today's edition we are uh, very uh, delighted uh, to have with us in the studio our uh, dear uh, guest uh, Yusuf uh, Grant uh, Yunan he is a student at the faculty of uh, economics and political uh, science hello Yusuf and thank you so much for being our guest hello and thank you uh, Yusuf, uh, can you tell us about, uh, you are in the fourth uh, year, almost, uh, it's your graduating year, you will yes. enter your graduating uh, year, so you are about to finish uh, your university. Can you tell us about the activities that you are doing during uh, the last year and the previous year, as we were talking before going on air, about uh, being the editor-in-chief of a magazine at the university. Can you shed light about that? Yes, of course. I started in the extracurricular activities almost in 2021. Uh, so I got uh, some experience, some good experience in this field. Yeah. Uh, I started as a vice president in model of UNESCO simulation, one of the best simulations ever in Egypt. Mm -hmm. Then I started to become a, a head of OC and Egyptian parliament model. And so on till I became the model, uh, the editor in chef in Hijra magazine and mm -hmm. the youth founder. Uh, this magazine, it's so lovely for me as it is uh, sponsored by uh, IOM Egypt, mm -hmm. uh, uh, Faculty of Economics and Political Science yeah. and also Cairo University. So it's, it's so impressive to, to, to make something like this. Indeed. Uh, Yusuf, uh, tell us more about uh, uh, the issues that you tackle in uh, the, the Hijra magazine and why did you decide, you as students, to establish such a magazine in the university? We have some lack in the magazine uh, if we speak about uh, migration. Yeah. Uh, a lot of people do not know the, the importance of migration and they saw uh, mm. about this topic even if it's very good idea or it's very bad idea. Mm. In Hijra magazine we decided to speak about this field to make like a comparison mm. uh, between the good and bad things in migration to make like a, a, a community of, of opinions yeah. uh, to, to be shared in this magazine. Mm. So we decided to make Hijra magazine to speak about migration. It is the first youth uh, magazine speaking specialized in migration. Yes. Till now, it, it, it was just established a few months ago. Till this moment, uh, uh, what did you learn from being the editor-in-chief of this magazine and what actually is your main target uh, that you want to achieve by being the editor-in-chief of this magazine? Being the, the founder or editor-in-chief, if you can say, uh, this gives you like a, a, a way to uh, crisis management. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you, you may see like a lot of things you do not uh, prepare mm. before, so you started to make the mm. instant decisions. So may, maybe it's something you can learn from being mm. a, a youth founder in Hijra magazine. Mm. Uh, then uh, I really uh, want to make this magazine a global magazine and I started taking mm. these places. Uh, so uh, IOM Egypt take a place uh, as a uh, sponsorship there. Mm. Uh, I decided to make this. Yes. Uh, did you get uh, to, to uh, meet the migrants uh, as you are working with the IOM, which is uh, indeed the UN organization uh, for our viewers for uh, the, the migrants? So uh, how did you learn as uh, on the personal level uh, uh, from meeting these uh, migrants? And uh, what's your um, aim? Uh, that you want to achieve by meeting these migrants and trying to help out in the society in general? Meeting some migrants for me uh, give me some emotional, some uh, str uh, like a, a, a sad, good feelings. Mm. So uh, mm. you on the, the personal space, you have to, to feel them and to em emphasize with them. Mm. Uh, so uh, I think that mm. we have to share this experience with a lot of people mm. to, 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 to see mm. the, 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 the lack they, they live in, such as Sudan, such as Palestine, such as everything around Indeed. us. Uh, so you are planning to continue with this magazine even after uh, in, uh, your course, graduation? Of course, of course. Mm. Uh, Yusuf, uh, apart and away from the magazine, uh, you are uh, a certified instructor at the National Institute for Governance and Sustainable Development at the Ministry of Planning and Economic Development. Be an ambassador 
initiative. Can you share the more light about this initiative and why did you decide to join? Okay, despite this uh, initiative started uh, yeah. a year ago, I got my certificate today, so it's a new... <laughs> a new congratulations. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Uh, this initiative uh, called the Be an Ambassador Initiative, uh, mm -hmm. it is about the sustainable development goals. So it is a very vital uh, thing to, to, to mm -hmm. share and to know, and it is about poverty, about hunger, about uh, reducing inequalities, about a lot of things mm -hmm. uh, that is very vital with us and mm -hmm. it is the backbone for uh, the, 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 the global uh, process. Yeah. Uh, before going on air, I, I did ask you about uh, what you want to do after uh, your graduation, which would be uh, hopefully after a uh, few months. And you, uh, can you tell me what did you say and why did you, uh, you are willing to, uh, uh, to, to do continue in this uh, career? Uh, actually, I want to be a part in the diplomatic sector in Egypt, yeah. uh, as I think that my skills and my languages uh, and also my experience uh, yeah. helps me to become a, a part of this, as I want to, 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 to help Egypt to uh, yeah. raise the diplomatic sector. It, it's also raised, yeah. uh, it's already raised, but I think that uh, making some uh, or, or raising to some youth uh, spirit yeah. will help uh, the diplomatic sector in Egypt. Indeed. Uh, what are your dreams uh, if you did join the diplomatic uh, sector and uh, uh, you became part of uh, our diplomacy, hopefully? Uh, what are the aims that you want uh, to achieve, uh, Yusuf? Uh, what do you want to change? What do you want to reach? What are your dreams uh, here? Uh, we, we have some uh, uh, relations, political mm. relations. Uh, mm -hmm. We need to, 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 to raise we need mm. to make some partnership, real partnership between mm. countries as I think that, uh, I believe that Egypt is a, a very historical mm. rich country. So I think that we have to put Egypt in its real place. Mm. So I think that in my sector, if I really join this, yep. uh, I believe that we can uh, reach the, the, the diplomatic sector with a lot mm. of, uh, of, uh, yeah, of countries. Yes, indeed. Yusuf will go to a short break and after that we'll continue our interview here, our dear viewers, a short break and after that we'll be back, so stay tuned. Thank you.
olhos e um brilho em cada olhar. Sorrindo juntos nós podemos ir além. Welcome back, our dear viewers, and back to our dear guest. Uh, how do you see uh, the uh, internship that you are having now in the Ahram Center for the Political Strategic uh, Studies and how did you benefit from such an internship use? Uh, the Ahram Center uh, is very uh, uh, historical reach mm -hmm. center for political researchers and it's like the, uh, the, the first place you, you have to go to, 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 to uh, be called a political researcher. Yeah, of course. Yes. Yes. Uh, Yusuf, uh, how did you benefit from uh, your internship in Al Ahram and why did you like to join other than, of course, being one of the pillars of the Egyptian uh, journalism and media? Uh, what are uh, your experiences, the experiences that you did gain uh, through your internship there? I can say that uh, after my uh, faculty, the, this uh, center gave me the academic tools and mm -hmm. the, the research tools to, to make like a political, uh, intensive political mm -hmm. research. Mm -hmm. So uh, I, can't, uh, I can from here thank all the uh, organizers in this uh, organization. Yes. Uh, as a, a young uh, graduate, almost, uh, Yusuf, what are your dreams? What are uh, the things that you want to achieve uh, since you are having uh, multiple uh, interests? Uh, you are having political interest, you would like to join the, uh, the, the Egyptian diplomacy, you are editor-in-chief of a uh, magazine, you are interested in the issue of uh, uh, migrants, so what are your dreams here that you want to achieve and uh, do you see that uh, you are still having some obstacle that uh, you want to um, hinder? Okay. Uh, I love the interdisciplinary fields, mm. so I think that uh, political, uh, theology, migration, Africa mm -hmm. and almost the, 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 the whole things I yes. believe or I, I research mm -hmm. in. So I think that this uh, can make like an interdisciplinary uh, science mm -hmm. uh, that I can benefit uh, with and be benefited also uh, in these fields. Mm -hmm. Some obstacles, yes, I think I still need some research, I still need some uh, mm -hmm. things to read, I, I, s I still need something to, uh, to, to some tools to, yeah. to write or to research with. Yes, indeed. Yusuf, also you had a fellowship in the Arab Council. Uh, before uh, going to discuss this, we are having some photos from uh, you. And uh, can you tell us about this photo, Yusuf? Uh, yes, uh, this was, I, I was the, uh, I still the mm -hmm. vice president at Model of IOM Simulation. Yes. Uh, and it's uh, like sponsored by IOM Egypt also. Yes. So uh, it was like a, a seminar 
and they was speaking about the, the migrants uh, and the role of uh, the Ministry of uh, Migrants. Indeed. So, yes, and this also, oh. I was at Taba Foundation and we were speaking about... Taba? Yes. Yes. Uh, and we were speaking about the uh, about philosophical and political uh, mm -hmm. aspects. So uh, it was my 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 role to to, to speak about this. Okay. Uh, this was at the radio. Uh, mm -hmm. I got like a, a ten minutes or twenty minutes to speak about uh, yeah. the achievements, but it was in Arabic. Yes. Okay. Yeah. That is Hedja magazine, uh, my new milestone. <laughs> yes, indeed. Yes, it was uh, this in Bian Ambassador Initiative as I spoke uh, about yes. this, and mm -hmm. this was at the final ceremony. Oh. This is Dr. Uh, Ronald Aidi, one of the most important speakers <laughs> in Egypt, in my, yes. in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Yes, this was yesterday. The, Just the yesterday? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> so it's a fresh photo. <laughs> yes, it was uh, yeah. when I got the certificate about being ambassador initiative. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. This was uh, 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 Mohammed Al Arabi, the, the former indeed, ministry indeed. Uh, of the foreign affairs, and I was pleased to take a photo with him. He was uh, inviting me to attend like a, a seminar about the uh, Sudan. Mm -hmm. Yes, it was uh, yesterday also. also? Yeah. <laughs> this was at my uh, faculty. It mm -hmm. was uh, when we uh, uh, was receiving our certificates after attending the uh, final ceremony about uh, mm -hmm. Egyptian Parliament model. Okay. I was uh, the head of OC there. This was in my first year in the, col uh, in the college. Mm -hmm. uh, I was uh, the head of marketing at Model of UNESCO Simulation, oh. and we got the first place uh, there um, uh, around like 200 simulation models. We got the first rank. Okay. This was also at EPM uh, Simulation Model while I was uh, expressing our uh, progress in this session. Okay. This was uh, uh, with Dr. Ghada Ali, a parliament, model, a parliament member, mm -hmm. and I was uh, there a research with, uh, in, in her team, and I was pleased also to, to take this chance. Aye. Yes, uh, if we uh, see the, the, the writers in this uh, magazine, mm -hmm. it was the, the, the editorial board, and we can see Dr. Amani Masoud, uh, the, the political science, uh, the head of political science department yes. in my college, uh, uh, former ministers, and the uh, great figures actually, uh, Yusuf as well, uh, joining uh, in the editorial. Yes, event. yes, yes. I was pleased to, to, to meet uh, them all. Mm. It was uh, this photo. It was it uh, mm -hmm. at COP28 simulation model with BUE and UNDP and yes. uh, Zaid University. The the you last year. You did join this. Uh, yes, 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 yes. And I got uh, one of the outstanding researchers. Okay. So uh, they they called me to to travel to uh, United Arab Emirates. Yes, indeed. Yes, it was also yesterday with uh, <laughs> Dr. Sharif Al Sharif. Mm -hmm. It was at COP28. United Arab Emirates. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. How, how, do, yes, okay, tell us about this photo as well. Yes, Dr. Amr Musa. Yes, indeed. Yes, it was a pleasure to, to, to take a photo with him. It was also in the COP28 simulation model, but mm. it was at the uh, last day. Mm. This one of the Same others photo there, yeah. Yes. Uh, I asked I asked her to uh, like uh, make the tradition uh, way to, to 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 take photos. So she told me the man in our country do like this and the woman do like this. Yes. It was uh, these photos uh, was in the elite magazine, uh, mm. the uh, faculty elite. Mm. So uh, I uh, I wrote like about six or seven articles there from year one to year four, yep. and it was one of the most important articles for me. So it was <laughs> very in the. Yes. It was another one. It was about migration. Mm -hmm. Uh, this was in Extra News. We got like an invitation to attend uh, a program there. 
Yes, it was in the year uh, in the in the event that I was the head of uh, uh, the vice president of IOM. Okay. It was the announcement to to, to know that I was the <laughs> vice president okay. at MIOM. Yes, it was in Taba uh, Foundation, as I previously said. Yes. It was, uh, this was about uh, COP28 simulation. I mm. make like a, a short brief about mm. what I, uh, I see. Yeah. This was at the uh, National uh, Institution for the Governance and Sustainable Development. Okay. Okay, uh, Yusuf, before wrapping up, uh, how did you learn and what did you learn actually from uh, joining the uh, COP28 uh, uh, simulation and visiting uh, the United Arab Emirates for this purpose? Uh, being a political science student gives you the way to negotiate of course. and to be a diplomatic person, of course. So I think that uh, when you meet a lot of people, all of them have his belief, have yeah. his language, have his opinions, yeah. uh, and also have his political opinions. So all of this uh, can be uh, settled in the COP28 simulation. Mm -hmm. We were about 32 uh, countries mm -hmm. uh, in the COP28 simulation in Egypt, in BUE, uh, with uh, around 150 students. So when you speak about all, uh, with all of these mm -hmm. persons, with all these religion, with all these cultures and so on, gives you the opportunity to know more about the... Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, finally, Yusuf, uh, as a person, uh, how did you benefit from joining all these activities, being uh, an ambassador initiative, the COP, uh, having your magazine of uh, Hijra? How did you benefit and uh, to what extent do you feel that it is helping you in your future career, Godswell? Uh, yes, I think all of this makes my experience uh, more intensive mm. and this uh, uh, benefits me, of course, mm -hmm. as from personal skills, as from uh, language skills, as for uh, a lot of skills, the, the way to negotiate, the way to mm. speak, the way to uh, uh, solve the problems. Uh, as for uh, meet another people, meet a mm. lot of people, of course, it is a very important thing, mm. your network, your net worth, mm. and so on. Do you link these networks? Uh, you joined uh, the parliament, uh, the COP initiative, or the simulation, the initiative of uh, being an ambassador. All these, did, did they benefit you as well? And all these figures that you did meet, did they benefit you in your uh, magazine as well? Of course. The, the first uh, public figure we have uh, making like an interview with, with her was uh, Her Excellency uh, Dr. Nabila Makram, Ambassador Nabila Makram. Of course. And yes. of course, I, mm. I knew her from previous uh, experience or a previous yes, event. Mm. So uh, I'm, I'm sure that uh, the, the link between the activities and make something new, mm. it will benefit of course. Indeed, uh, Yusuf uh, Grant uh, Yunin, uh, our political science and economics uh, student, thank you so much. Thank you. And wish you the best in your future uh, career. In thank you, of course. Thank, thank you so you. much, Merci. Yusuf, for being uh, with us today. Our dear viewers, with that, we come to the end of this edition. Till next week, many thanks for watching.